Alright guys, I just want to start off the video by saying that the, the game audio actually did get destroyed for this video, so all you hear is my mic and me talking. There is no like game audio or like the bulldozer running or like birds chirping in the background. It's super annoying. I don't know why that happened. I don't know how it was destroyed or lost, but that's what happened and it was so cool we made the shooting range. I was like, dang it, we, we just, we had to upload it. I just want to let you guys know that's what happened. That's why there is no game volume. Sorry about that. Let's get right into the video. What is up, guys? Welcome back to another Spencer TV video. We are here on our police map. It's Goldcrest. Our police station is right here, guys. And we got some construction equipment because we are going to be making a shooting range, boys. We got to make a shooting range. Somebody in the comment section a while back was like, yo, Spencer TV, make a shooting range for your cops. So they can practice shooting. I was like, you know what? That's a great idea. So we got our, uh, we got a bulldozer. We got some scrapers over there, and then we got a wheel loader there. So I'm just gonna drive them over. Um, so again, here's our impound lot. We we don't have really like any cars in there because we had to deliver them all back, or not deliver them back, but like we had to turn them in after so long. Uh, some people picked them up, others didn't. So we just like give them to the scrapyard or whatever, or the city. I, I'm not really sure, but. There we go. Okay, so what we're doing is we are making a dirt backstop. We're going to be making a dirt backstop. We're just going to be making like the the kind of like the, the fundamentals of it or like the core of the actual the actual like shooting range. So we're just going to be building the backstop. We're going to fence it off, get some gates to get in, make sure no strangers get in, but as you can tell, we do it, it's a it's a pretty safe spot. To have a uh, shooting range because as you can tell all of this is like elevated and if, it, if a bullet makes it over the backstop it's not gonna like do into town and then also that little house right there is run by cops so it's not too big a deal with uh, like the noise I guess you could say okay what I want to do here is I want to start or I there we go. So she's unloading there. She'll be picking up. We just got to let her unload. And then let me, first off, let's shut this bad boy off. She's a little loud, don't you say? Okay, so we got the wheel loader. This is going to help kind of get it really, really high, get it piled up good. And then we also have scrapers over there. I don't know. I kind of just got them to get them, and they're really fun to use. And they're, and they're honestly, like, one of the most, con one of the coolest, like, construction mods we got in the game i'll try and link some of this below by the way guys um i'll try and link like the police pack and then maybe the d7 d the cat d7 r yeah d7 r i was just making sure what the heck why did it oh why did it stop no Susan. what there's something wrong with the little one Maybe, I don't know why that happened. She needs to be dumping, boys. There we go. I'm thinking, I'm thinking we just make a huge pile here. Then we kind of move everything, make another pile like in the middle. Then another pile right here. And we just keep on going down the line. I'm thinking maybe it's when I tab over that it, that it like stops. I can't see from here, but it, from here, it looks like it stopped making the dirt um, appear or whatever. But maybe it's because I tab over. We'll, we'll have to go over and see. Uh, okay, here's our scrapers. We got two scrapers, guys. Look at these bad boys, the Ashland scrapers. So the, the, the bottom comes out, and then it picks up all the dirt, and then you can, like, kind of drive and spread it out. It's really, really good for, like, collecting things. We actually did it. We made a shooting range on the squads map. That was super fun. Uh, we had, like, the big bud, like, three of these things. Uh, all like stacked up it was I think it was me and Owen and then squad and yeah it was crazy we made it decent but we're gonna make the shooting range way better and we actually have a purpose guys we got a police station we need to train the new police cadets or the new deputies make sure they still got their shooting eye their shooting hands ready all right there we go is it it's still pouring because it's going like minus 44 dollars other so it must oh Holy Toledo, I did not see that big cat right there. Oh, we're going to be taking out a south side. Watch the fire hydrant. Oh, okay, we didn't hit it. Yeah, this is a load. Okay, it is It is still unloading dirt. So that's good to see. But as you can tell, guys, 
We are slow moving. This is a slow moving train. We actually had to, uh, when we made the shooting range with the squad, we were driving such far distances and going like, going like vertical or up hills that we had to get the big bud because this thing only goes, as you can tell, like 11 miles an hour, I think we got on the street, 1110. So yeah, we had to get the big bud so we could get to like 19 and not waste our whole entire day. Just, just getting the dirt or the materials there to actually make what we need to make. Okay, so we're pulling up here. There's the old dirt. No dirt, she's starting to pile up. She's starting to pile up, that's what we like to see. So I think we're just gonna let her run right now, let her pile up and see how big it gets and then we might move to a new, kind of a new spot. All right, let's see how big this bad boy gets. All right, so it stopped making dirt. Is that maybe because it's getting too close to the conveyor belt? Let's find out. So I'm going to raise it up a bit. Send it out a bit. Maybe try and make like another, just make the pile bigger in general. That'll happen. Maybe that'll work, boys. All right, so it's unloading some more. And I think we're going to start working while it does unload. So I can send it out, as you can tell, um, some more. I really want to try, okay, we're going to use the dozer first. I, I have the wheel loader here so that like if we need it, stack it high, stack it high. The dozer is good for pushing boys. Obviously, she's got the big old tracks on there. She's got a lot of horses in her. Hop in, see, see what we can do, boys. We got to kind of like spread it out and as it builds it up. Holy Toledo. Oh my goodness, boys. We literally just took that out with the dozer. I just dropped that big old blade. She did some work, but yeah. We don't need it that wide, I'm thinking, but we do need it relatively wide. I'm gonna try and push some there, but I, I don't think the dozer like picks up at all. I think it kind of just like flattens it out, which isn't bad. That'll, that'll, we'll have to keep that in mind. Oh, maybe it does. And maybe I just didn't have it down for enough. But what I was trying to say is I, I was a little worried that the dozer wasn't going to actually pick things up. But as it, it does right there, it does right there. All right, then lift the blade up. There we go. Okay. Yeah, but when you like drive backwards, then like if you somehow like get any of the tracks on the dirt, if, if you saw there, it did kind of flatten it out. I'm thinking, boys and girls, that we maybe get... Uh, no, this this will probably be good for unloading. I mean, if we work while this unloads, this will be pretty... This will be a lot of dirt. A lot of dirt. Okay. What I want to do, guys, is just for the heck of it, I don't think it's too realistic. Not real. I'm not, not realistic, but, like, necessary. But I really want to try what we got going here out. So let's open... All right, what we're gonna do is we are going to the first one. I think the scraper is dropped. Yeah, right there, it's dropped. I'm going to drive. How do I, okay, is this how I open? I hope I'm able to pick things up. You picking them up? Oh, we just bottomed out. Come on, old challenger. We got a challenge for you. Holy to later. Get some speed. Come on, big cat. There we go. Now we're scooping things up. But the question is, do I have to have this down? Do I have to pop it open a bit? No, I don't. I'm going to keep it closed. All right. What I'm going to do to the other one, same thing. And I think she, she loading up back there. I can't tell. I can't tell. Um... No, I can't really tell. Maybe there isn't enough dirt. Yeah, it's kind of maybe maybe we should get another one, guys, because this this I mean it'll be a pretty big uh sort of deal here. But okay, maybe we only need one scraper. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what we do here. We got one full. I'm just gonna keep letting that pile kind of build up. 
This costing us a lot of money, boys. A lot of money. Okay, let's go to the G. Do I, do I gotta lift the scraper up? Okay, lower scraper. Alright. Literally, like, unloading nothing. Why is it doing that? I felt like it totally would just dump last time. Just, like, that would have been all gone in that little stretch. I honestly have, like, no clue. What the heck? Alright, we're coming back for another pass. Here we go, boys. We're coming back for another pass. Straighten it up. Alright, it, so it's unloading right now. At an extremely slow rate. Not sure why. Maybe we have to lift the scraper up. There it goes. There it's start. Okay, I got it. So if we want to unload it a lot at once, which obviously we do, we have to lift the scraper up, which would make sense because if we have it down, it's kind of like hitting the bottom. Maybe it can't like unload good or whatever. What the heck? You stopped unloading. See, there's. I think the pile's too much for her, boys. Think. All right. Yeah, see, okay, so the pile, we're going to have to smack the pile down, and the best thing for it, boys, check this bad boy out. We're just going to keep, honestly, just keep, let it, let the dirt kind of build up, and then just knock it down, and I want to push it that way, because this is, it's going to be, this is where the kind of place is going to be at. Okay, there, that's probably good. Oh my goodness, we might need a lot more dirt, boys. Okay, what we're going to do is we are going to have to get another conveyor belt. Jeez Louise, I thought this would work. We're going to need more. We are going to need more. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to buy um, conveyor belts. The little one, we need the little one. And also we do need the big one. A little big, I love how I just call them little big. All right, let's go to placeables. Beautiful, beautiful. And where is our dirt? Yo, dirt, we need your dirt. All right, here we go, right here. I think well, it'll, it'll start here and kind of like end right here. Pretty, pretty big, a good size backstop, I would say. Okay, so first off, let's turn this bad boy off. We're gonna go hop in our little tractor over here, decent sized tractor. I wouldn't say little. I wouldn't say little. I'm trying to be mean to any of you, to, uh, tractor fan here, boys. All right, we're flying over. We're flying over. We gotta pick up the little. I could pick up the little one with something else, maybe. But anyway, there we go. The little and the big one. And then, yeah, we're going to start making another pile. Two should be good. And the problem is, guys, whenever I buy, look at this. Come on now. What is this? Whenever we buy, okay, we're just smacking it. The problem is, whenever we buy things here, guys, this is exactly what happens. And I got to, like, grab it and, like, hit it. And I don't want to hit it because it's new equipment. But you got to do what you got to do sometimes. Oh, well. All right, let's see if we can attach. There's the hitch. This is so sketch, boys. This is so sketch. No, I can't. Come on. Come on. Give me something. All right, we got to hit her some more. Got to hit her. Oh, 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 oh. That's not good. That is not good at all. Here's my real question. Can I hook up? Can I hook up when it's flipped over like that? It's on its stomach. Can I hook up? Oh my goodness, look at that. We just did a little gator roll with our conveyor belt. That's insane. Okay, let's try and swing wide so we don't take out that wall for the police station. That would be terrible. All right, we're going to slip through these trees. We're going to dodge them. Oh, look at that. Look at that. We just thread the needle, boys. Okay, we're hauling back. Turn on the beakers. We're coming in hot. got to let them know. Holy cow, our place is looking real nice. Okay, but we do need a little one. We have to have the little one because you need the little one to pick it up off the ground and then the big one to pick the, what the little one picked up. And then, If it makes sense to you guys. There we go. Okay. I, do I have control of it? No, I must not have control of it yet. All right, we're going to fly back over. The pile's looking good. We might have to... All right. I'm going to sprint over here with the bulldozer because I know by the time I get over there, the conveyor belt will probably like recognize that there's too much dirt in one location. That's why we got the old D7R. Flap this puppy. That's a big pile. I'm surprised it's still going. 
Oh my goodness, boys. Look at that work. Dropping the blade. She does work, boys. Nice. Looks good. Okay. That's kind of all we wanted. And then, again, it, like I said, that is getting a little too wide for comfort. That's why we kind of got the wheel loader and the dozer to kind of clean up the edges and then keep building up, building up, building up. So we don't really waste any dirt. But this this uh, this backstop's looking sick. And, yeah, I didn't really find a, a purpose for the scraper so far, boys. Because we aren't really... We're just creating dirt, like, out of really nothing right now. We don't need to. We don't need the scrapers to like transport it. That's what I'm trying to say. All right, let's. Uh, we're we're bypassing into the police security. They don't know we're here. Can we like back up? Maybe I'm. I just need to get it out of here. Not out of here, but off there, because we hook up um on the other side. There we go. Okay, nice. We got that. Got that good hit there. Now she's lined up. Now she's lined up. And now we just got to back in and get our work done, boys. All right. Ba -da -da. Back then. We're good. We're good. Okay. Now we're going to be having times two in production of dirt. And I think things will go a lot faster. And we'll have to pretty much like stay in the dozer and the wheel loader the whole entire time. But there. Oh, she got a little squirrely on us on the curb doing a little uh, tricks there. All right. She's still pouring. That's what I like to see. But this is starting to take shape. I feel like it's going to really start to take shape here. Now that we got another dirt invader belt. Oh, let's not do that. Love how we can just make dirt out of anywhere with these placeable dirt mods. And these dirt mods are awesome, guys. I'll, I don't know if I'll be able to find a link. These are extremely old. But again, if you guys ever want to use the mods that I'm using, just literally go into Google, which I hope we're all familiar with that. And okay, let's turn. All right, there we go. Then I need to click. So just go like on a mod website, or just honestly, you'll go FS17 um, dirt placeable dirt mod, and it will work. It, you'll find it. And yeah, it might not be the same version as me, but you will get the mod. That's what I'm trying to say. There we go. Okay, there we go. We're unloading. Nice, and yeah, that's pretty much how I do it. I like If I, I see somebody using a mod that's awesome, I'll just get, type in the mod name, and then it'll, it'll, <clears throat> it'll just like pop up. So that's just a little hint or tip. And if you guys don't know how to download mods, just go check out either my video that I made a long time ago or the squad's updated um, video on it, how to download mods. Just type squad, how to download mods video, and that's the best way to do it. All right. There we go, boys. We got to start. We got to get some work done here. It is totally taking shape. I would 100% agree that it's looking really good so far. But I think I what I want to do is kind of maybe clean up the edges with the wheel loader. Because the dozer is not that good at stacking things too high. Here we come, boys. Paper. Hop in here. Got the beakers on. All right. I feel like I'm doing a little mining. Not going to lie, boys. This brings me back to my good old mining days. You always use the wheel loader just like this. All right. So if you see what I'm doing here, guys, I'm kind of just cleaning up the edges. Uh, yeah. Lift up there, and then I'm going to kind of connect the two. Oh, maybe I should... What I should do is I should actually make sure the dirt piles are lined up. Make sure that we do that. Okay, I'm going to hop into this conveyor belt. Um, they, all the controls are reversed on this. I'm trying to figure them out. There. That looks good, doesn't it? They look lined up. Yep. Oh, guys, look at this. We're getting a shower. We're taking a shower. That's actually... It kind of feels like it's real. It feels like I'm standing here getting a bunch of dirt just poured on me, boys. This dirt is very important. Oh, yeah. we're Oh, let's get the shampoo in. Nice. Okay, good. Um, so This is actually important. This dirt is going to be stopping bullets. Taking the... Okay. Be a lot of police shooting competitions out here. We got to make sure that everybody's safe within the boundaries of the shooting range. And if bullets do like go above or to the right or left of the of our backstop here, 
honestly, it's not even that big of a deal because they're just going to hit like another backstop. Like a, a natural backstop, let's say. This is our little artificial one. Um, but yeah, we just don't do it. Maybe accidentally hit a deer or something. That would be pretty cool, though. All right. Yeah, we're making dirt now, boys. We're making it rain dirt. And hey, what do we do now? What do we? I'm just waiting for it to pile up. What do I do? I'm trying to figure it out. It's starting to look super good. Starting to pile up real nice. Try and dig a bit here. Maybe. <clears throat> Oh, we can for sure make it wider than this. Okay, we'll dump some right here. <clears throat> and then I'm thinking, while that pile is absolutely humongous, maybe we just shorten and bring it down to this pile right here. Then I'll pile up here, and then I'll pile up there, and then be this one we kind of, we'll have to like, one is I feel like that one might be producing more dirt. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. But let's uh do a quick little time lapse of us making some dirt, boys. All right, boys. The piles are really starting to get big. Big. Really, honestly, like taking shape very, very nicely. And and yeah, we are going to start kind of. Uh, that's about as high as we want them. I'm thinking. At least that's what I think. Um. Yeah, we are going to. To clean up any scraps around here. Go lift up. It's just kind of sweeping out all the dirt, making it kind of look pretty. And then, yeah, so what we have to do primarily, like that's as high as we could ever really need. And uh, we need to fill in this middle. That's what I'm thinking. Thinking we need to fill in this middle, and the best way to do it. To come up underneath here, get the wheel loader in there. Can I fill a bucket up? Did I fill it up at all? Yeah, we did. Okay. Um, we're gonna swing it off over kind of maybe. Oh, I need to turn on that first. Okay, let's swing it. Thinking kind of over here. But I don't have to like get on top of the pile. Boom, boom, and then just kind of back up. All right, there we go. Now we're unloading there. And I think it'll work. This has worked in the past. No, it goes right through my bucket. What the? Yeah, it goes right through my bucket. Dang. I really thought that would work, boys. Not gonna lie, I thought that would work. Oh well. Oh well, that's not gonna work. Okay, so let's just keep the scrape in here. Take some from the pile. Yeah, so I'm just gonna kind of take whatever we kind of make there and kind of pretty much just drive it over here, unload it, anything extra, and just keep kind of scraping. We don't need it like fat, or we don't need need it like too wide. Bullets aren't gonna be going through all this stuff if it's like so wide. There we go. Okay. And yeah, I just want to take dirt from the left and the right and flap it in the middle because we can't get a conveyor in the middle. Then here, maybe I should start making some placeable like. Maybe we should start placing down some stuff. That might be smart. All right, so what I'm thinking we're gonna do, we got placeables. First off, we gotta put Spencer TV sign right here, boys. This sign, oh, wait, wait, wait. Here, I have a good idea. This is the shooting sign. This is the first shooting target. We're gonna shoot at the squad. Oh, we'll place that at the end, so if we have to drive around, we don't like smoke it or hit it or anything like that. All right, where is our, what, what am I looking for, boys? We're looking, oh, there she is. There she is. We got to get that. Um, maybe we honestly do like these barricades. These might be a little more of not a might be a lot more official. Because we are shooting once again. We do not want anybody like running in here. It's secured off. Dealing with weapons. Bullets flying, boys. 
it's just a shooting range, but we're gonna make this look official and right. I'm thinking I don't want to put them around too much because then we aren't gonna be able to like drive around properly. Okay, nice. There we go. Face it the other way. Boom. Boom. And then yeah, I'm just gonna kind of construct what it might look like here. Off. There's the two sides. Looks a little crooked. But what can I say? What I'm not the best, boys. All right. So I'm thinking. We'll have to make it quite a bit longer. Maybe. All right. So here's the entrance. This would be the entrance of the fence. Or of the shooting range. Okay. Place it down. Look at those dirt. Things are still going. Let's make sure that they are. I hear one going. This one quit. Okay. Let's. Yeah, we cannot afford to not have one going. What is going on, Jimmy? Send it out some more. There we go. Now she's working. Now she's working. Okay, nice. Yeah, it's starting to. It's really taking shape. It's awesome. Looking super good. There we go. And then I'm gonna apply more of the barricades um here. Let's make sure that I make a straight line. Because as you can tell, boys, it's a little crooked there. Try and fix that. Just the hair. Boom. Alright, this is looking super duper good. I'm sure when we're done with this, really good. Nice. Okay, there we go. We're gonna do a quick 180. Spin it around. Yeah, it's kind of cool. Looking from an aerial kind of uh, viewpoint, we'll be sure to fly over it too here shortly. It looks super good. Okay, place it down. Please. Little hot zone gate. We gotta pass security. Get in this guy. Real nice. That's good. Place looks awesome. It looks super good. Now, like, the, obviously, they're going to have targets and all that. You get done. Obviously, they're going to have, like, benches and stuff and, like, a shelter area. Maybe we could, we'll, we'll place the shelter area. I know we can do that. We got one of them in here. All right. This will be kind of uh, the closest thing we got to a bench. Come on now. All right. This is the closest thing we got to a bench. This will kind of be, like, the hangout area, maybe. Here, one there. Not the hangout. Yeah, people watch, people shoot, and make sure like everybody's like got their guns loaded up and stuff. All right, I'm gonna start taking some of this stuff from here, putting it in the middle because we don't. Again, that's why I kind of moved it off to the side. to take the cat. Start grabbing all the dirt that we don't need. Perfect. We're full there. Oh, dang it. Now the other one's not running. All right, boys. This this one load like this in our bucket, we can fit so much dirt. It's in, it's absolutely insane. All right, I'm going to take some from over here. For some reason, this one quits at like, oh, what the heck? Still more dirt in there, guys. I thought we emptied it all out. We'll have to get the dozer in here and kind of push any other scraps we got kind of lying around. There we go. Okay, nice. Now it's all empty. That's what we want to see, boys. All right, let's get it down here. Kind of raise it up a bit. There we go. Okay, knock it down, and then we're going to come back. Maybe take another chunk. Okay, now we're going to form the middle some more. Yeah, I'm going to have to, we're going to hop in the dozer real quick, boys. Make sure we kind of don't miss anything. I don't know if that was a good place spot to place it. There we go. Okay, nice. And then, yeah, we might be about done here uh, with the dirt. But, yeah, it's, it's turned out super good. There we go. Okay, now let's place some more dirt down. Let me hop in the dozer. Let's get... The last little bit of stuff kind of cleared out here. 
All right, super nice. This is awesome. Honestly, like, we could take a lot of dirt from the backside here. Okay, let's not do that. I'm going to have to get the wheel loader for that. I'm thinking. Yeah, we might have to get the wheel loader for some of this. But I'm going to drive around the front side and see if I can push kind of the little mistake that we made with the wheel loader. Yeah, it's it's looking super awesome. Oh yeah, I'm going to have to grab the wheel loader and fix the back there. We got to mess it up. Kind of distribute it more evenly, I would say. That's what we can kind of do with the wheel loader. There we go. Trying to make a good, clean line. Not going to be perfect with the dozer because we can't really like get it up there too far, but sure is good at like plowing and pushing. Raise it up a bit there. Nice. Okay, awesome. This is insane, boys. This is insane. Okay, let's hop in the wheel loader, drive around back. Then we should be good to go. We should have the middle kind of level with the two sides. Good. Very good, honestly. Watch out for that rock. We don't want to take a rock out. That's probably like a huge rock. Probably like as big as a car, but compared to our rock like wheel loader, it's nothing. Oh, did they both shut off? Yeah, so I think we're good on dirt. We have enough dirt. It lasts us a very long time. There we go. And I'm just going to kind of clean up this back here. Thinking. Kind of clean this all up. Scrape it. And then see, it doesn't get it all on like one kind of push here. But it slowly does its job. And I think we should be good after a couple more kind of back and forth there we go because I want to use this dirt guys we don't we don't need it on the back side here I want to use it in the front and kind of pile it up high all right there we go we got a full bucket boys all right I'm thinking we kind of put it right about there raise it up there we go we still have more more to dump yeah, see, I can't dump it all. All right, there we go. Okay, it looks super good. Not going to lie. That is awesome. Super good. Okay, guys, this is going to wrap up the video. Hopefully, you did enjoy. We'll, we'll, we'll get all this construction equipment out of here. But super awesome video, and it turned out really good. I'm really happy. Um, We did get to use the scrapers. That's cool. But anyway, guys, if you did like the video, make sure to smash the like button. Please subscribe if you are new or have not already. I would greatly appreciate it. And yeah, guys, peace out. Have a great day. And again, thanks so much for watching, guys.